What's up, YouTube? Mike from Mass here, Mass Aquariums, bringing you the 40 Breeder Jungle Fide. And I wanted to give you guys a little glimpse into what happens when you remove your circulation pump. Um, flow is important in any tank. And while we do have the outtake of the Fluval 406, you know, pretty powerful, creating some nice surface agitation. Uh, there's really not a whole lot of flow going on in this tank. You do see like a gentle sway from this dwarf sag. But I had a circulation pump over here that I removed and uh, due to a uh, non-working order, I might say. And within about a week, my Anubius is covered in brown diatoms. Now, why you might ask? Well, you can see the new growth. Uh, closer to the surface is completely green and brown algae free and as you can see all these leaves are covered in brown diatoms now the leaves aren't dying they're alive they're just covered in brown algae because there is no flow in this part of the tank absolutely zero um, you can see the moss is out of control I mean Blixa just floats away and starts to spread everywhere this is about the only wide open space on this side of the tank um my atomic diffuser is blowing co2 blub bubbles 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 like crazy um got a nice runner right there runner 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 you know so my substrate is nutrient rich that's for sure um i love to keep this wide open space here in fact the quarry cats that i thought had all died all like to gather right underneath here um, very tough but look at this root system super super healthy roots but this video is about lack of flow and what it can do to your tank when you have in uh, insufficient or not sufficient amount of flow and you get dead spots in your tank this is what happens you get brown algae diatoms forms settles there's nothing blowing it off the leaves aren't moving and i don't have any auto cats in here to eat it so that's what you get fishies don't like it when i come too close to the tank especially with all the kids running around but you have this beautiful lush green growth everywhere and when you have lack of flow this is what happens brown algae diatoms do not panic you can see in this corner as well, the dwarf sag is starting to get some uh, brown diatoms. Do not panic. Just increase your flow. Do not allow dead spots to enter your tank. So I'm going to put another circulation pump right here. I'm going to get some flow. I'm going to blow it all over the Anubius and uh, should be back to normal within uh, a week or so. You can also get your, you know, get a paper towel, get your thumb in there, wipe all the brown algae off. But... You know, if you don't have anything to prevent it, it's just going to come back. Look at that giant, giant Blixa. Oh my goodness. This tank is completely jungle-fied. I may have to thin this out shortly or start over. I'm really not sure what I want to do. But I'm going to do something soon because this is out of control. Jungle. Mike from Mass. Out.